In this video, I'm going to talk to you guys about what's going on in the world right now and because of what's going on in the world, the future of this channel for 2021. Yesterday, where I live in my area, we went into our second lockdown because of what's going on in the world right now. Back in March, when we went through our first lockdown, I was absolutely miserable. I allowed it to pull me down. My anxiety, I let my anxiety go wild. I had so many sleepless nights. I was worried about everything. I was scared of the unknown. I was scared like everybody else scared of the scarcity of the food at the grocery stores. I was scared for my YouTube channel. Nobody was caring about losing weight anymore. I didn't know if my channel was even gonna make it. I was scared about my other job. Were we gonna have money for groceries? I was scared, was there even gonna be food to buy? There were so many unknowns. Would the world ever be what it was? Did it matter? I Everything in my head. I let it make me miserable for months. And then in the middle of the lockdown, I said, life is really short. And I spent the last few months where everyone was locked up in their houses. You couldn't go out. That was extra time that we could be spending with the people that we loved, that we live with. And instead, I spent it in my head instead of every moment present with Kyle. And I finally said, this is enough. I have been allowing the situation to scare me so much that I am miserable, my anxiety is at its worst it's ever been, and I'm letting all these days pass me by where I could be fully enjoying it with Kyle. On YouTube, going like this because does it really matter? I can just be me. And instead, I was like this, miserable, not sleeping, scared of everything, and I finally said, enough is enough. I am not gonna let this lockdown pull me down anymore. And I came out of that lockdown, I grew. I faced a lot of my fears. I stopped letting my anxiety in. I started facing stuff. I started letting go of the unknown and not being scared of it anymore. So when I went into this lockdown yesterday with Kyle, we said, this time, it's not getting us. No matter what happens around us, we're not gonna be scared anymore. We're gonna keep facing our fears. I made the choice to not let this one get me down this time. I'm gonna film the best videos that I can. I'm gonna enjoy every single moment. And I realized the first lockdown, the reason why it got Kyle and I both down is because the carrot on a string, the they's said, it's only two weeks. Just do this for two weeks and everything will be fine. Then it wasn't two weeks. It was the rest of the month. Then it was wait till summer. Then it was, oh no, it's still, until now this is lockdown number two. Oh, if you just wear a mask, if you just get the bing bing when it comes out, it's always, if you can just wait for this, it'll get better. Guess what? That carrot is never coming. It keeps slipping like a bar of wet soap. It just keeps going bling and running away. So finally, Kyle and I said, no, this is enough. We are not letting a carrot on a string keep us thinking, oh, it'll just get better when? Before they said 2021, everything will be perfect. Well, guess what? It's almost 2021 and we're in another lockdown. What I learned is if I keep thinking it's gonna get better when, or if I keep living in fear of not knowing what's gonna happen and I just keep, I'm just gonna keep myself stuck. You're giving your power away too when you yes. let the they's of the world tell you what to think, how to feel, when to live, when to be happy, what emotions you should share with others, the fear that they're spreading around that then we as humans spread to other humans. Yeah, and then everybody feels your energy and then we all stay stuck. Well, this time my energy is gonna be, it is not going down. And you know what's funny, what me and Nicole realized helped us wake up. We did the same thing, our e we let our ego do the same thing to us in weight loss. Yes. Our ego kept saying, you know when you get to a certain weight, It'll you'll be, be happy. Perfect. You know, you, 
you know, you have this food now and you ate pizza tonight. So don't start on Saturday, start on Monday. Yeah, in the meantime, until Monday, you can just eat everything in the house. Then Monday you'll get a perfect body when you eat chicken and broccoli. We did that for years. Then the first lockdown came around and we were just like, okay, once they tell us what to do, once they say it's okay, everything's gonna be all right. And reality is, if you can't be okay with where you are now, it's never going to be okay. Stuff might completely go away. It might just be fine and this is done. But if you're not happy with who you are now, if it gets better, you're not going to feel better inside because you're not working in here. You're focused on the stuff on the outside, the external, which is what Kyle and I were focused on too, until we realized we got to go in here and we got to feel good in here. And so it doesn't matter what you're struggling with right now as you're watching this video. It could be with what's going on. It could be fear of the unknown. It could be that you're also in a lockdown where you live or you're not sure if your job is going to be stable or be there or if you're struggling with a relationship or with your weight, whatever it is, I'm gonna challenge you now the way that I'm challenging myself. Find something that is holding you back, that you have allowed to hold you back, to stay stuck, to be scared about, to have anxiety about, and write it down in the comments and work on that this year. Make yourself happy Whatever it is, make the choice. We have a choice. No matter what happens, it happens for us, not to us. You've got a choice with whatever you're struggling with. You can let it make you or break you. I am not gonna let anything break me anymore. I'm gonna pick myself back up and I'm gonna keep working on myself until I am the best version of me. And me I challenge you to do the same. Me and Nicole did because we spent a lot of time at home in 2020, like all of us, yeah. we did a lot of shadow work. Yeah. And we realized we were attached to things that didn't matter anyways. And the they's were using those attachments to keep us in a very low, very sad, very depressed state. And they want us to stay there. And they keep promising stuff that never happens. So if you continue to be stuck with whatever you're struggling with and you keep listening to your head or the outside world promising you that if you can just hang on a few more minutes or days or months or years, it'll get better, it's never gonna happen. We have to take the stand. We have to pick ourselves back up right now and let us, don't let it break you. Make yourself out of this. Whatever challenge you've got, Make yourself better. Be your best you. Take a stand with me and Kyle right now in the comments and tell us you're gonna make 2021 the best year that you've ever had and you're not gonna let anything pull you back. And we're not gonna be dependent on the circumstances. No, it doesn't matter what it is. Kyle and I are letting stuff go and we're gonna be on, I'm gonna be on camera, he's gonna be filming me, and we're gonna be making the best content to help you and to let you know you are not alone. We are all gonna face whatever we're struggling with, whether it be weight, this channel's about weight loss, but it's also about loving yourself, having a good relationship with food, and we're gonna do the best that we can to help you out. You guys stand with us. You are not alone. We're together in this. Let us know what you're working on. I'm working on being the best version of me. Kyle's doing the same. We're not gonna let any circumstances take us down. Let's do it together. And the friends, I don't care where the world is going, what they're promising, what's going on out there. This is the energy that I am bringing to this channel for 2021. Fun, love, we're gonna love our food, have a great relationship with food, I'm gonna in, try to inspire you and help you and let you know you're not alone. Weight loss can be fun. This journey is fun. No matter what challenges we come across, we're gonna face them together and we're not gonna let anything hold us back because we're all doing it as a team. This is a team here and we're doing it together. And also, watch these two videos. Um, do this. <laughs> Say hi to Hank. Check out my two, our two weight loss guides down below if you want them. Exactly what we ate to lose our first and next 50 pounds. Exact meal plans and portions and family friendly recipes. And...
did I say watch these two videos and subscribe and get on Instagram and um, uh, hit the bells and frog it? What can you Yes! Dog slippers. <laughs> <laughs> Love you guys. You're not alone. We're here. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up. <laughs>